Yeah. We ain't even finna do all that. I get a lot of comments and, and, and people asking me, how do I stay motivated? What do I find the motivation? I want to get into the best shape of my life, but I don't have the motivation. Let me ask you something. Do you have goals? No, seriously. In all seriousness, do you have goals that you want to reach? And more importantly, why are those goals important to you? That's what we're going to talk about today. Let's go! We're going to talk about goals and why those goals are important to keep you disciplined and that will in turn keep you motivated okay so it's not necessarily about motivation motivation is something that can drive you to do what you're doing but the discipline is what keeps you going okay so what are your goals let's set some examples say you want to lose weight all right cool how many pounds do you want to lose whatever it really comes down to why why is losing weight important to you why is it that you want to lose weight what's the real reason is that reason something important to you let's say for family reasons for health right let's say it's a confidence thing let's say you know you want to be able to go ride something over at bush gardens down in tampa whatever the reason may be that reason is what needs to get you in that mode. That way you're disciplined, you're locked in, and you're striving towards that goal every single day, okay? If you don't have goals, if you don't have a drive to do what you're doing, it's gonna fall short for sure, almost every time. So I really need you to lock in, okay? This video ain't gonna be too long, but I, I really need to come on here and talk about this because I keep getting asked that. How do you stay motivated? How do you keep doing what you're doing? Let's talk about my personal reason, okay? I was always a skinnier kid and this is part, I'm actually gonna make a video about my, my reason for getting into fitness, but I'll give y'all a little snippet. I was always a skinnier kid. Um, I did martial arts, I was a tri-sport athlete, martial arts, um, football, and ran track. So I was always constantly burning calories, but I didn't have much muscle on my body. I always felt weaker like i knew how to fight but like i always felt just weak and frail and i didn't like feeling that like that anymore which is what led me into football where i was you had to work out morning and after practice so that quickly became one of my favorite parts of the game of football is lifting weights and getting stronger because you need to be you don't want to get tossed around like you don't want to get little boy all over the field you know what i'm saying you go line up on somebody to press them and that wide receiver just mm. You know what I'm saying? You didn't want that. So you really had to get strong. So that's where it really started for me. And it kept me going. And now the discipline portion was I worked out night and, and after practice. So I was working out two times a day for four years, right? Then after that, I really just kind of kept with that because I was doing it for so long. I went and got my own gym membership and I just continued at least once a day to work out for an hour and a half. So what is your discipline you need to set a goal for yourself why is that goal important to you and then you need to take the necessary steps to getting to that goal maybe it is you wanting to build muscle we well, need to learn how to do that okay i highly recommend hiring someone for a short amount of time maybe you don't have the most money in the world find somebody that fits your budget and have them teach you the best way I mean, there's some people that are self-taught, but the best way to learn something is to have a teacher, a trainer, a coach, stuff, something like that, that can teach you the way. Because a coach's job is not to just hold your hand for seven years you know, while you work out. They're teaching you how to create structure. They're teaching you how to eat correctly. They're teaching you how to progressively overload. Sh they should be teaching you how to do all this stuff. And if your coach is not doing that, and you're somebody that really wants to do that, you need to have a conversation with your coach or find a new coach. Once you learn how to do all these things for yourself, hopefully you can go on and do your own thing. And that is when, that's where the discipline's gonna come in. Cause now you're not gonna have the coach. So you need to be able to 
stay disciplined and stay on course to continue fighting towards that goal. That motivation will come and go, but that discipline, if it's always there and if it's ingrained, ingrained in you, then you're gonna, you're gonna continue to excel towards that goal. And you might hit it, which in turn will then set another goal and then you'll hit that goal. But this will be ingrained in you for, for almost the rest of your life until you physically cannot do this. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's lose weight, whether it's build muscle, whether it's, you know, a fight sport trying to train for like Muay Thai or, or, or any anything like that you know what I'm saying it's it, it everything's the same it's all the same that discipline comes first I'm not gonna babble on too much more on this video I just wanted to hop on here and make a short little video for you guys um, hopefully this this and go on please subscribe subscribe come on what are we doing hit the, hit the, hit the thing hit the thing okay the little thumbs up thing subscribe Let's get it going, man. We got this motion going. Let's keep running it up, all right? And then my, my, my lights are purple because, you know, our blue-eyed, our blue-eyed brother there, Stoturo Gojo, is, you know, I got me a Gojo little statue right there. Shout out Blake. And um, shout out T for this T. <laughs> it says, Murio Kusho, which is, the domain expansion and here's the cool thing about it for anybody who gives a damn you know what i mean that be cool y'all don't got that y'all don't got that i know y'all don't got that <laughs> anyway enough of that um i appreciate you guys for watching the video i appreciate you guys coming and fucking with me again um like i said before like comment and subscribe let's talk in the comments what's keep what what has you guys going all right what what why did you guys start your fitness journey? Let's talk about that. And then I also, like I said, had a, vi a video um, about how, why I started. So I'm gonna make a whole video about that. So you guys stay tuned in for that. Um, I also have a day in the life of a personal trainer coming out. So we, we, we got things going and then I'm going right back to Legendary Legs to finish the series. So I will see you guys on the next one. And remember, I fuck with y'all a long way. Peace.